Original veteran, a man called Lone Ranger, ain't no stranger. Big up, dancing clear. Big up, I'm really cruel, you see? Zulula, 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 right? I love what that, I love what that, I love what right? I love what that, I love what that, I love what that, I Oh, you get your love, bonesa. Oh, you get your love, bonesa. Right. When you're young and in love, oh, when you're young and in love, mm. right. Oh, the love bones, dear sir. Do it. Oh, the love bones, dear sir. Say that you come out now, your face like a damn disgrace. You come out in a while and make your feet as look spoiled. You broke a little more and then it turn out in a sore. I love that, I love, I love, boom. Dancing clear and really cruelly. Original return for them case man called Lone Ranger, ain't no stranger, say, kick it. Right, guys, still here in Jamaica. Right now, we're at the crossroads outside the biggest theatre in Jamaica. What's it called? The Carib Theatre. The Carib. And we have, listen, I don't even know how to introduce him, but a real veteran out there in the music industry. The one and only Lone Ranger. Greetings, Welcome. greetings, greetings. So Very good nice. to have you. It's a real privilege. Yeah, yeah we, we yeah, appreciate it. Yeah. Right, some quick fire questions. I'm going to keep it short and snappy. Yeah. And I'm going to start off with what age did you get into music? Who and what inspired you? Well, I got into the age of music at um, 15, 1975, 1976, just coming from England in 71. Um, listening to different kind of music. My mother used to keep the um, old session in London. Okay. So, you Which know, part in London? Um, Tottenham. 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 Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Nice. And then, um, North London. Yes, you hear that? North yes. London, yeah. And then um, going back to Jamaica now and hearing the reggae music, I used to listen to man like um, Uri, mm. Big U. Yeah. And, you know, I started to use my lunch money oh. and buy the records, carry it home, yeah. Yeah. rewrite their lyrics. And you know, back in those days, you have to have the version on the flip side. Right. So I write out the A side, and then when I write and study, turn on the stereo, put on the B side, yeah. and then practice. Oh, nice. yes. Okay, do you remember the first single you bought? The first single I broke was, um, I don't know, it was, I think it was Orisandi. Orisandi? Yeah, it was Orisandi. Nice. Yeah. Okay, so what school did you attend and what are your happy memories of school? Yeah, at school, my, I used to attend um, Vauxhall Junior Secondary School. Okay. As you know, when I came from England in 1971 to Jamaica, yeah. the school was kind of hard to get into. Begin, couldn't get there. Right. So I had a second with the box Okay. Yeah. Did you like school? Box was nice. It was okay because I kind of a little more advanced. Right. And I played football for box I was doing drama. Nice. You know, I got scholarship uh, from the Governor General Football Scholarship to go to JC College. I never reached because, okay. of, because of the music. Right. Right. Okay. Yeah. What well, what would you do support? Locally or internationally? Internationally. When Chelsea was the team at the time. Oh no, you just said the wrong answer. I was going to live in Tottenham. I was going to live in Tottenham. I was school was at White Hart Lane, yeah. Tottenham County Grammar School, you know? Okay. Yeah. yeah. But you're a secret Liverpool supporter, right? Okay. I won't tell nobody. Yeah. <laughs> All right. What's your favourite album by another artist? Yeah, uh, let's see. Um, Ebro. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Alright, what's your top three sound system? Virgo International. Okay. So, Alright, so for 2019, what is your goal? Sky is a limit, uh, you know, so I do a lot of recording, yeah, a lot of touring, okay. yeah, you know, just so want some people to make it out there, you know, yeah. working on it. I'm sure they're going to come out with yeah, soon. Yeah, they're going to be, yeah, they're going to yes. be. Alright then, so other than musically being a musician, artist, um, 
Well, I think you're up to the top. Well, he's like a jack of all trade, master of none, because he's got to do it with the But, he's got to do it with Right. Like DIY. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Okay. Right. So if you could go back in time and do something different, yeah. If you could go back and maybe change something the way you did it, maybe do something different. Is there anything you can think of? Not really. The one thing I can't change that's too much. She's my baby and she reflects Now in the morning when the sun comes up She gives me comfort in my favorite cup And I know, oh yes I know oh, Hallelujah when I love her so Right, a little live on, slow Butcher, a little live on, slow Nice, nice, thank you Alright, so when you're performing out there Do you ever get nervous? No Never? No. Wow, that's good Have you ever had a block? No. Yeah, that can't. Yeah, that, yeah, that can't. How do you style it out there? You said it. Style it you out. You style it out. <laughs> style it out. That they don't know. They don't know. They don't, what they, they yeah, don't know. yeah. That's good. That's good. Okay, so for up and coming artists, say there's somebody out there they want to come into the music industry. What advice would you give them? Let them have a try. Let's do the music properly before we enter into it. Before we get into the music, there's so many things that I have to copyright. You're the most powerful man in Jamaica, yeah? High and above the Prime Minister and anybody else out there. What would you do? Yeah, I do. Yeah. Is there any changes you'll make? Is there something you'll make sure would happen? No, we said no, we said we the people there, you know. People in poverty yeah, yeah, and stuff. Yeah, taxis and people who hide. People in the cockpit, you know. Would you want to, yeah? He's walking past. What question would you ask him? If I asked him? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I put you on the spot now. Yeah, that's what I said. Well, Bojo, how things go here? How are you working out? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And you know, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Really, really. It's a good time. Alright. So, you, I guess, you know, being an artist, you have traveled quite a bit. Yeah. Is there any country you've not been to and you'd like to go to? Well, being right inside of Africa. Okay. Yeah, inside of Africa. Any particular I've been, near, I've been near there, even Gambia, Ghana, Nigeria, okay. Okay. In South Africa. Mm. Yeah. I've just been on the outskirts, the outline, you know. Right. Israel, Cameroon, Jordan. How did you find it, Israel? Ibiza, nice. nice. Very nice, yeah. very nice, powerful. Yeah. yeah. I went there recently, it was a good experience. Crazy, man. Yeah, really nice. good experience, nice, really nice. nice. Yeah. Alright, so. I'm going to give you another difficult question. No, I'm not. <laughs> um, right, so in terms of what can the people expect from you? 
future was? Are you working on any albums or anything new? Well, I have a lot of albums working on, a lot of singles, and I'm working with a lot of independent producers right. and big time producers. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't want to say too much, so I just want to keep the thing until they're ready. You know, they're gonna... Right now, I have a big tune out there right now, just released. Mm -hmm. a, a, re, a rebirth of the Love Bump Rhythm with Lone okay. Ranger and Ikea okay. right now. I do a thing out there. Mm -hmm. Just release, so we'll watch and see what Alright. Okay. So, on behalf of myself and Don Sinclair, thank you very much. You're we welcome. appreciate that. Definitely. Appreciate the time. Respect. It's a real honor and privilege yeah. to have this time with you. Yeah. Is there any message you have for Don Sinclair and myself in terms of the work that we're doing? Well, it's a good thing. I love the work and we keep doing the work, get the, get the message out there, right? And there's a lot of errors they make out there, wrong things. You can correct that and set the record straight by meeting the artist and doing exactly what to do. Thank you. Thanks so much. Yeah. So, guys, there you go. You heard it live and direct from the veteran himself, Mr. Lone Ranger. Ain't no stranger. Make sure you subscribe and follow up on the interview, and we've got much, much more coming up.